Hi everyone, Brendan from c21teaching.com.au here. In this Flip to Teacher professional learning video, I'm going to show you a tool called Tour Builder uh, that's been put out by Google that's going to be really useful in the classroom for capturing timelines, whether it's from history, whether it's from a novel, huge range of ways that you can use it. All you need to do is go to tourbuilder.withgoogle.com. You can see that up here. You'll have to sign in with a Google account, give your tour a name, but once you've done that, it will bring you to a screen that looks roughly like this. Now, I've started putting together a tour here based on Burke and Will's expedition from 1860. And what I can do is click on add location, type in the name of a location that I want to appear in the tour, and then click on add to tour. And it will drop that down as a marker. So what you can see is over time, as you drop in each of the markers, it'll be able to trace the route. Now, it obviously is only going to give you the straight line, or as you can see, it will only give you the straight line route, not the actual day-to-day -day route that the people actually took. But what it gives you is the ability to add in photos and videos related to any particular location, uh, dates, uh, other information. So for something like this, Birkin Wills Expedition, you could put in highlights. Okay, they left from Melbourne. Where in Melbourne? When did they leave? What time did they leave? Uh, are there any photos or videos that are available that will enhance that? Um, for Swan Hill, when they were there, what happened at Swan Hill? Um, who did they see? What did they do? You can add in all sorts of information that will uh, help you do this. What you can also do is if you are reading a, a book, whether it's a historical uh, or whether it's fiction, is you can use it to trace the journey of the character. Things like um, War of the Worlds uh, or any, anything about the Kelly Gang. Um, you know, there's a whole range of ways that you could use this in the classroom. Students could do this as part of an assignment. They could perhaps be asked to trace a route of a particular expedition or a character from a novel and fill in the details at each stop or come up with the details at each stop. Uh, use this to some kind of uh, expedition journey, um, a direct expedition journal rather. Um, there's a whole range of ways that you can use this in the classroom. It's really easy to access to a builder.withgoogle.com, sign in with your Google account and click on new expedition. To add, an, add a location, simply click add location button here, type in wherever it is that you want to go or you want the tour stop to be, Menindi was the next one, you can click on add to tour done just like that really really simple I can now zoom in and out once I've done I've finished that let's say that that's finished a finished tour let's click on done editing up here and that's now ready to go and I can now share that with my students and down the bottom here I've got my back and next buttons and we can actually go through the tour you could also set this up at the beginning of a unit and as you move through each stage of a journey um, you know go to that particular location in the journey You've got some other options here, play full screen, open in Earth, export, create new tour. Have a look around and explore this. Really easy to use and potentially really useful. I hope that's been helpful. Don't forget, for more FTPL videos, head to c21teaching.com.au. Thanks very much for watching.